I've been playing amateur basketball for like maybe since I was five or so. And I just love it. Trying to have a fluency of understanding the game, respond to new situations. I really see a, a jazz band very similar where you have a fluency of what you're trying to do and you're going to respond to each other. To me, that's such an engaging, exciting thing to be a part of. In either mediocre basketball or, or jazz music, you know, you can lose yourself in it. Wes Carroll has held an appreciation for music since early childhood. His first love was the ukulele. Graduating to a three-quarter size guitar in his pre-teens. Discovering the wonders of the electric guitar as a teenager and briefly becoming a head-banging heavy metal artist. Finally, establishing a self-described froth of jazz, hip-hop, and soul. His influences are varied, from Jimi Hendrix to Miles Davis to Tupac. They're all styles of music that were very much from the heart. They're storytellers, channeling energy and telling stories in their own way. And Wes now channels his energy into composing his own stories. Like, I can't get up when I'm trying to write. You know, I'm just following my ear and it feels like kind of tingly. One of Wes's first big breaks was winning the Lou Williamson Jazz Award from the Victoria Jazz Society. His audition CDs or even the cassette tapes at that time were outstanding. Wes turned the scholarship into a jazz studies degree from Vancouver Island University. I think performing is a whole other thing that you can't learn in music school how to do. But luckily for Wes, there is the Victoria Jazz Festival. His first performance at Jazz Fest was quite brave because he had really had just um, a year of uh, training in jazz under his belt when he did that. He likes to breathe, stomping upon the ocean floor. What he's doing now is um, his own compositions, very sophisticated music, and um, his own arrangements, and so on and so forth. So, a tremendous qualitative leap over the years. This is what it's all about, uh, encouraging our local musicians to take their chances, explore what they're capable of. He has become a, uh, a favorite of our jazz festival. Much like a professional basketball player, Wes has put in countless hours of practices and performances which have paid off as he was accepted into the prestigious jazz program at the University of Toronto, where he'll be earning a master's degree. A large reason for, for going is just because I want to get better. Getting yourself out of the pond that you're currently in is a, is a quick way to speed up that process. 